Hello everyone and welcome back to The Sims 4! We are here with the Green family and their beautiful sprawling legacy mansion that has so many new additions to it. And I'm actually thinking about adding a basement pretty soon, but before we get started I have to say holy moly updates! There have been so many updates added to The Sims 4 recently and several little stuff packs. There has been the luxury stuff pack and there has also been the perfect patio stuff pack, both released. I don't have either of them just yet so unfortunately we're gonna have to wait a little while to give our sims hot tubs and to have a beautiful decadent chocolate fountain and all the pretty dresses and everything that comes with uh, the luxury stuff pack but we will get them pretty soon and i have been downloading so much amazing custom content oh and there's new crest now so there's an entire new neighborhood that's what i mean there's just updates all over the place oh and that reminds me i saw in one of the updates oh my gosh no i'm okay Yes, there's been updates, so that means the tutorial, the tutorial monster is back out to get us. But let me dive in, because I know I saw in one of the updates, and you can see we've got a little, look at that, look at that, we've got a little cactus, we've got a little cactus that we've managed to get, some celery, what is this, is this eggs? Oh, they're droops, I've never had a droop before, but I assume it's some sort of plant. But yeah, let me see if I can find, ooh, look at all these. The little gnome. I know there's a little gnome somewhere around here. There's the freezer bunny. Here's the happy gnome anniversary gnome. Um, I love all of the little free updates. Here's the guardian of the gnomacy. But I love all the little like hidden pieces that they stick in the updates. There's the barley gnome. Oh, and look, yeah, we do have little deer for uh, putting out at uh, the Granite Falls area. So we'll probably add those guys out there. Here's the Into the Woods. This is so pretty. Yeah, there's a lot of custom content that I'm going to be digging into, but I'm looking for this guy. Look at him. Look at him. It's Don't Fear the Nurper, or however you want to pronounce that. Don't Fear the, the Reaper, but it's... How on earth would you even... How would you pronounce that? You guys tell me. How would you pronounce Neganomper? It's like a very awkward, awkward way of trying to say Reaper. Also, one second. I just noticed. I thought something felt a little bit fiddly. But I just noticed that... Yeah, no Sims 3. Yes. Okay. Oh, that's right. You can't go into tab mode when you're in, <laughs> in build mode. Oh, I'm just being silly. Sorry about that, guys. But check him out. So there's this little dude. And he was kind of like a little hidden addition. Oh, he's got such a cute little outfit. I really like him. I love how he even comes with the normal gnome, like, red head. Little red hat. Oh, I don't know what it is about these gnomes. The more they add in, the more I just start falling for them. But yes, there's been tons of updates. I have tons of new custom content. I'm actually going to start doing some mod highlights on the custom content because this community is freaking amazing and has produced some stunning stuff that I just want to share with all of you, especially anything plant and garden related. I actually think we might start a mini series across all of the Sims games that focus on uh, gardening and like plant related custom content. But enough of that for now. So we are exactly where we left off last time. And so much has happened in the Sims world around the Green family, but it's time to back dive back into actually working with the Green family. Looks like everybody is either off to work or school right now, except for Lily. And if you guys recall, that is because Lily has just finally finished working on an upgrade on this, this right here. Her rocket ship. And I guess we need to give it a name. It would be really fun if we could, like, name it. But I want to send her to travel through the wormhole in just a moment. First things... I think we're going to have her go eat something really fast. Uh, oh, there's some leftover yogurt out here. 50 minutes until spoiled. Let's eat it before it goes bad. And then what's Iris doing? She's doing a painting because we have no money. And I bet we have bills to pay again, as usual. And Tate, where are you? You're using the sink. Oh, no, you're using... Oh, he's using the little microscope. Aw, Tate, look at you. You're being cute, but you need to go help like everybody earn some money, okay? He wants to get to know his wife, too. That's adorable. And holy days. I know it's probably just me, but I feel like everything is um, going a lot faster than usual. I'm going to have him harvest all. Pharma. Wouldn't it be cool? You know what I would love? A mod that would let us harvest ah. the cow plant for milk and sell the milk at their new little farmer stand. And we are actually going to be doing kind of like a little a build, a speed build for their farmer stand pretty soon so that we can 
just decorate the whole thing. Uh, I'm, have, I'm gonna have to figure out a way. If anyone knows of a mod so that the shelves don't get dirty, please let me know because I think I saw a mod like that and now that I'm actually like having to play the game with move objects on and certain items in certain areas, it's really hard when like these shelves get dirty to keep things sold. So we're gonna have to fix that. All right, Iris, speaking of selling things, let's go ahead, sell this to a collector. Where's your husband? He can come down and get to know you. Oh, he's coming down to harvest the plants. Well, we're going to have him get to know his wife, because that's what he wants to do. Ask about career, boast about family. See, they already really, really, I guess, get to know. They already really know each other, so I'm surprised that he even has the option to get to know her. But we're going to focus on the lily girl here in just a moment. Oh, there was not a lot of food there. I don't want to send her traveling to an alien planet without being well fed. Uh have lunch. Let's have her have a quick meal. Have a quick meal. Let's have a healthy glass of orange juice. And we'll let her take care of her needs. Iris, are you so cute? What do you want to do with your husband? Be funny with Tate. We can handle that. Let's see. Funny. Tell a joke about aliens that your sister is just about to meet. Your sister-in-law at least. Alright, Lily, are you ready? Today is going to be a very big day. A big day in some kind, Lily. Because you are, you're going to go off into space. We're going to go visit Sixam, the alien planet that you can travel to through the wormhole, I think. I've never seen it. I have purposely avoided any Let's Plays. I've avoided any screenshots. I've avoided anything that like shows off that new world to me because I want it to be a huge surprise. I think this might be the best we're going to get on her, her skills. Lily, drink the orange juice. There's no one to talk to. Just drink your orange juice, my dear. Oh my gosh. Well, let's have them come and sit together. Because they might talk with Lily before she leaves. Oh, great boost. A big unit test is coming up in history class. Ash has been doing okay, but a good score would really boost his overall grade. He sounds like somebody who would like panic at the last minute and study a lot, so let's try that. Yay! He gained a small performance uh, gain, so that's good. Alright, come in here, you two. Since Lily's taken forever to drink this orange juice. What? You're already done with the orange juice? Alright, we'll go ahead and what does she want to do? Become friends with Iris. Well, share brilliant ideas. Oh, crazy diagnosis. What? Crazy diagnostics. There we go. Okay, so this will be Zoe. Moments before a big launch, the avionautics on the shovel or our shuttle are acting up, blinking and beeping like crazy. It might be nothing, but it might also be a terrifyingly fatal error. Should Zoe scrub the entire launch or proceed and hope for the best? No, 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 no. Zozo, Zoe especially is somebody who would think about everyone else's safety and well-being before like her own pride or worry about work. Uh, Zoe's bosses are screaming in her ear, but the grateful astronauts inside the shuttle are glad she made the safe call. Zoe has the team look uh, into the equipment to find out what's Jeez. wrong. Okay, Moving so that didn't seem to do anything go bad or good. Uh, right, it, you way. sit down. <laughs> now what does he want to do? He wants to be friendly with his, his beautiful wifey and try for baby. Boast about your family then. Go for it, dude. Alright, can you two become quick friends? No, you, you, you two cannot become quick friends. I'm sorry. Oh! Iris can now upload images on a computer and sweet talk to other sims. That's adorable. Well, I'm sorry, you guys, but Lily has to leave. I, I, I know, we're rushing her, but she's got to go do this. Why is there... Aw, this sink's broken. Tate, you're going to have to fix the sink. It's going to be a thing. All right, but we're going to have Lily suit up and travel through the wormhole because that's just going to be so exciting. How are you two doing? She wants to kiss somebody. No problem. Romantic. Um, let's see. Suave kiss. There you go. All right. Let's do this. Let's do this, Lily. I'm so excited. Hurry before everyone gets home and I'm like overwhelmed with simmies to take care of. This is still one of the most beautiful paintings I think Iris has ever made. Maybe we should sell copies like at an art gallery or something. Oh, you too. They're just so cute. Bright and day. They're adorable. All right, Lily girl. All right, here she goes. And actually, I would like to take a moment to let you guys know what Lily is doing here, traveling to space and dabbling in science. We're probably going to have her daughter, Alia, 
take up the science. So Alia is probably going to go into the science career to satisfy both her mother's intense curiosity about the natural world and continue to help her aunt and uncle out with their little farmer's market. Okay. And who knows who Alia might fall in love with? Who knows who Pine, like Pine fell in love with um, De Devin, Devin. So we need to add Devin in. But who knows what Devin will want to do? Also, did I tell her to travel through a wormhole? I think I told her to travel through a wormhole. I'm pretty sure I told her to travel through a wormhole. Maybe? Yes! Oh my goodness. I'm so nervous. I hope this works. This is supposed to work. Beam down. Travel through the wormhole. The ship hurtles through the wormhole and emerges near an alien planet. A series of odd noises comes from the on-ship radio, and Lily is suddenly teleported off of her ship. <gasps> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, yes! Look how cool this is! Okay, so we are now beaming down to 6am, I believe, and there's geodes! Apparently, there are geodes and alien plants that you can find on 6am, so let's collect as many as we can. We'll bring them back, and we will have Alia help us tend to them up inside of the observatory. So this is this is so exciting. This is exactly what I want. But I wanted to mention our plans for Olya in the future as following the science route because some of you <gasps> you guys want to see and do some new things. And oh my gosh, 6 am. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, Lily! <gasps> Lily! Lily! Oh, Lily. Lily. Lily, 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 Lily. It's oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Lily, this is beautiful. Oh my goodness, that's the whole planet! A moon! <gasps> what are those? Oh my gosh, those are geodes. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, Lily, I'm really excited right now. Look at this! So that's the return home. Oh, what is this? We can collect these. Oh my gosh, what's this? Yeah, there, look at all these weird little things we can collect. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, this is beautiful. I was expecting it to be beautiful, but I, I wasn't quite prepared for like this level of completely beautiful. Oh my gosh. Lily, we just need to figure out a way to let your daughter travel here, and then I think that Alia will be hooked forever on wanting to explore this area. Look at these rivers. Oh, and the sounds here. You found a crystal, a sapphire crystal. Oh my gosh. Oh, I see. So, like, they regenerate crystals at these locations. Oh, goodness. Okay, let's come over here. There's, like, a landing pad and everything. It looks like all sorts of ships could land here. That is so cool. Oh, my gosh. What's this? Lily, what is it? Oh, it's so cool. What is this little bubbling thing? Come here, Lily. Let's find out. <gasps> the plants sparkle. Look at them. Lily! Lily, this is the best thing ever! I'm so excited for you! <gasps> they float! There's floating rocks up there. Oh my goodness. I just... You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of Spore. It kind of harkens back to when Maxis and Spore like, oh, were semi-related. What do we find? An alien? You mean that's like an alien nest and we just reached like in there and like plucked an alien out? Oh my gosh, where is it? Where is it? <gasps> Look, it's a little light blue slug! <gasps> no way! Lily girl! Yeah, we're definitely having your daughter come here. We're definitely getting Alia excited about this. Because Lily's going to be an elder soon. She's got only 11 days and that's going to go by really quickly. Okay, so she's thinking about geodes. What did we just get? An unpolished geode. So if we polish it... <gasps> Corbut! We got Corbut! Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Um, collections guide. Alright, so we're not worried about gardening and things like that. Oh, we still have things I need to collect as a gardener too. I can't believe that. That's like embarrassing because we've been collecting them for so long. Um, but as far as... Okay, aliens! So there's one more live alien and three more dead aliens to collect. And geodes, here we go. We, yeah, we got all of the, the decorative eggs that were a limited edition item. And now Corbett. Common, true blue 
Zur Korbut managed to unite the ancient clans. He ushered in the modern era of tranquility, with, where the search for the ultimate party is prized above all else. Oh my gosh. Legend has it that Korbut was able to champion the most legendary party ever held on 6am. Everyone on the planet look, took part, except for the holdout, <laughs> Glumbert the Wet Blanket. So there's five other, like, geodes, common, 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 and common, that we need to find. Oh, I love this. I love these plants. They, something is making, like, this really soft, beautiful noise, too. All right, let's keep exploring. Oh, there's a little path over here, too. Oh, 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 there's an alien. Okay, hello, sir. He's just wandering around here. Well, let's get Lily's social need up, why don't we? Mm-hmm, okay. Let's see. Cheerful introduction. Let's just do a nice, cheerful introduction. His name's Wade. Wade Stapleton. Sir, you need more of an alien name. Maybe that's just, like, the humanish name that he picked for pronunciation issues. Oh, boy, <gasps> We can harvest this wild quill plant! A small but vicious looking alien plant that grows spiny quill fruit! Oh my gosh, yes. Oh, Lily's having fun talking to him too. Lily has discovered that Wade is an alien! The disguise seemed perfect, except for that one rather well alien detail. I, I don't think that was really a problem. Wow, look at the boost she got! Oh good, and Ash's grades are going up! Everybody oh, else is still gosh. really, really high up. Uh, That's so cool. Yes. <gasps> A female alien! Cheerful introduction! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Maribel! You also <laughs> need, like, a more alien name, but that's kind of cool. Look at them! <laughs> oh, I was thinking maybe Alia could fall in love with an alien. Maybe one of the others. Maybe Ash? I actually have a special plan in mind for Ash, believe it or not. Look at this! This is totally what Lily would want to do. Can we invite? I wonder if we can invite people here. I wonder if that works. Can we do that? Care for self socialize, switch control, build skill. No, no, no. See, I want to be able to, like, invite somebody up here. I wonder if we can do that. Oh, he wandered off. Oh, bye, Maribel. They're both wandering off because they're tired. Well, I'm going to collect a microscope sample from this thing. This is just too amazing. Look, there's like little floating flowers and everything. Lily, I'm so excited. This is this is like the best thing ever. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. I don't know why I put coming off here for so long. Okay, so she now has a little sample. Let's harvest this. Oh, what a cute little thingy. So we harvested that little thingy. Okay, let's get another one. Uh, collect sample and then harvest. Can we fish in these waters? Oh my gosh. I would want to move here. Oh, it's just too... It's, oh, <gasps> another plant. Another alien plant. Oh my goodness. Lily girl. More! There's more right over here! View the orb stalk. Ew! I hope it doesn't have eyes. I have an issue with alien plants that are, like, made out of eyeballs. It's just a thing I have. Alright, so she's collecting a little sample. What does she have to say about viewing it? She's studying it up. This is a wild uh -huh. orb stalk! Thank you, Lily! I would have never guessed. Oh my gosh, she's feeling like a genius, too. I'd feel like a genius, having come to an alien planet getting to wander around on its surface, collecting wild plants. Wild alien plants. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, I could see how one trip here would change Alia for life. All right, there's something over here and there's something over here. I think there's supposed to be like a lot somewhere over here too. Oh my gosh, I just can't stop. There's all these little bits and pieces. Wild tentacle tree! Let's harvest that up too. What are you finding, Lily? This is so exciting! 
Also, let's tell Holly to take care of herself because she seems very tense. Care of herself. There we go. And meanwhile, you, Miss Alia, I'm going to make her um, build skill, charisma, tend to the garden for your uncle. I love how we can command him to do that. I wish I could be like, hey, Ash, do your homework. Build skill. Let's have him build his video gaming skill because that's what he would be doing. <laughs> What'd you find, Lily? Oh, a capsule! Oh my gosh, we're gonna look inside it to see what kind of capsules are found up here in space. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's another one of the, the geodes. We're getting a lot of those. Oh, Lily. This is just so pretty. Oh, this is gorgeous. All right, well, we are going to continue exploring on this planet just a bit more to see what else we can find. I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be, um, like, a lot nearby. Oh, there's another orb plant. <gasps> yeah, we're going to continue exploring just to make sure that we have everything we can find here. And then we will go back and spend a little bit of time at home trying to get the plants to, like, grow and prosper. These new ones. Oh, my gosh, look at it. <gasps> it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Oh, I wonder if we could even explore this whole thing. I kind of want to let Lily step back for a little bit and let her daughter explore. Oh my goodness, there's like this giant rock thing here. Oh, it looks so cool. It looks like there would be more room to explore like if they ever decided to expand this. I would buy an expansion that opened up the, the 6am world even more. I think there's supposed to be like a party lot somewhere. That's Lily. I don't know how to get home. <laughs> I'm already lost. I'm like, wait a second. Where did we just come from? Where are we going? Oh, dear. Okay, let's back up a little bit. Ah, here it is. Okay, so this would be where we came from. This would be our little ravine. Yeah, we will be coming back here a lot. And I just remembered there, I think that... Um, there's so much to gather and collect and explore. I need to see if there's a way... Oh, there she is. So there's an alien just wandering around over here. But I need to see if there's a way for Lily to bring her daughter here, Alia. So we can get Alia deep into the sciences. Now that Lily has finally achieved one of her major goals of being able to travel to space, it's time to show Alia what it's all about, why it's so awesome, and bring her here. And I think we can also edit the slot so we can swap it out to be like a, um, uh, maybe like an embassy, an alien embassy to come and meet other aliens and things like that here. So I'm really excited about all of that, and I will see you guys next time. She's feeling really confident from having discovered an alien. She likes that. Uh, but yeah, we'll gather up some more of the amazing plants we can find here, and then we will head back home and get started on analyzing and planting them and just having the family settle in and getting ready because actually uh, our wonderful Ash, so little Ash and Holly are getting ready to age up pretty soon, so they're going to be moving out sooner than later. And I have some very special plans in mind for them, so I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye!